Hey, uh, what's up guys? Uh, back again doing another Skylander uh, video. Um, I wanted to not only jump on and uh, show this video as far as uh, um, some characters adding to the collection, but in some previous videos where I kind of did more bang for your buck type, type of uh, thing, um, I'm going to break down exactly what I did with this, uh, with this starter pack. Now, what you have in front of you is of course the Skylanders uh, Swap Force starter pack. Um, it, it's not a retro video, not going backwards or anything, but, uh, truth be told, uh, even though this launched in October, I never did pick up the starter pack for, for, uh, at least this starter pack for a few reasons. One, um, the starter packs are usually around forever. So even if I didn't get it at the launch in October of 2013, um, here we are, uh, mid-year, almost mid-year into 2014, and you can pretty much go everywhere and find this starter pack. Sometimes you'll see it, uh, originally when it came out, it was $74.99, something like that, in the stores, wherever you went, whether it was Walmart, GameStop, Toys R Us, and, um, so I chose not to pick up this starter pack. I, I didn't necessarily have these three characters, um, because uh, at the launch, I decided to get the uh, Dark series, which had their Dark counterparts. You had the Dark Blast Zone, the Dark Washbuckler, and of course the Dark Ninja Stealth Elf. Now, uh, so what I did was, since I already got that starter uh, pack with the Dark series, it came with the portal. I was going to be able to play the game. We we were able to, um, which of course we got for the PS3, because uh, I'm a I'm a Sony guy. Uh, we have the Xbox, um, uh, just don't have the portal for it. Uh, we have the Wii U um, and the 3DS version and whatnot. But ended up not getting this starter pack uh, just because, like I said, we had that portal and we were still able to have gameplay and all that kind of stuff. Now, what I pretty much did was uh, wait. Uh, just recently ended up picking up this starter pack. And as you can see, it's even for the uh, new gen set of, uh, new gen uh consoles the, this one being the ps4 um so so that way we have the portal for the ps4 we have the portal for the ps3 and uh, and and so on uh what i ended up doing was waiting until toys r us had a really good sale i mean these things uh actually uh were at toys r us the starter pack uh, the ps4 starter pack for 37.49 so what I did was I went ahead and took advantage of that really good sale. I uh, picked it up for $37.49, which I'm going to show the receipt in a second. Also, what I did was I combined, as you can see around uh, the background, you have the uh, McDonald's, uh, uh, which I just did in a previ previous video. It has the McDonald's Skylander uh, figures. Now, if you got these figures in each one of the figures, you had the Skylander $10 off coupon. So, and these, uh, you were able to actually combine with the, uh, with the, uh, the sale, if you will, that Toys R Us was having during that short uh, window. I think it was for a two-week period that they dropped it down to thirty-seven forty-nine. I mean, you can still go into the Toys R Us right now, and they're or or Target or Walmart, and they're like uh, sixty-four ninety-nine. You know, so it was a significant drop. Now, what I did, of course, it being thirty-seven forty-nine, took advantage of that ten dollar off. The starter pack and was able to drop it down to twenty seven forty nine. Uh, if you watched my other videos, uh, I I have on our mobile, uh, on our uh, actually on my iPhone, uh, the Shopkick app, which we walk into the stores. We're already doing the hunting anyways. Take advantage of the walk in kicks and the scan items. We're already in the stores. And I did that for pretty much half the year and was able to pick up a $75 uh, gift card for uh, Toys R Us. So basically what I did was I waited for the sale, used the $10 off coupon, and then turned around and uh, used my $25 um, gift card out of the $75 that I had earned 
and basically was able to pick this up, this starter pack, PS4, for under $5. Uh, so basically, I'm going to show the, I just showed the coupons. This is the, again, PS4 starter pack. I didn't have to wait. We, we were able to have a lot of gameplay because we had the Dark Series uh, portal. Um, again, here's the $10 off coupon that was accompanied with the uh, McDonald's uh, characters. And so what I did was I turned around and I was able to take this. And here's the receipt. The $37.49 that it was coming out to be. The $10 off with the coupon. Brought it down to $27.49. $38.86 with tax. Use the $25 shop kick gift card that, that was totally free that I used uh, with the um, walking around and, and uh, doing uh, scans and, and earning kicks for walking into the stores. And Walmart, just uh, as of a few months ago, Walmart, you can actually earn walk-in kicks uh, there. And so it brought the total down that I came, cash, $6, and got $0.14 cents change back. So just wanted to jump on. Again, a lot of people said, oh, my God, Activision. They turned around. They did a new portal. Um, and, you know, it's going to cost money. Now, of course, it did originally because we bought the Darks um, series portal. But with this one, and now I, I never had these characters right here. They actually get added to the collecting count um, of the um, Blast Zone, Washbuckler, and Stealth Elf. And um, I know uh, with, when people were saying there's, a, there's another portal, we have to spend the money. I ended up uh, being able to get this with those characters that I didn't have of their original counterparts and um, pick it up for only $5. So if you're willing to wait, you can have really good deals. Um, I certainly uh, appreciated uh, being able to pick this up for, for under $5. Um, anticipating the release, of course, in October of Trap Team, um, you are going to unfortunately have to buy another portal, the Trap Tanium portal. And um, but if you think about the technology involved and everything that's going on with this series, if you're a huge fan, I understand spending the money. It is kind of a, a bummer and a drawback. But to be able to push the envelope of everything that they've done with these characters and how the gameplay is, I love the concept of where they say originally it was uh, bringing toys to life and now they flipped it to bringing life to toys. And you're able to use those crystals or the uh, keys with the elements, gameplay, trap enemies, play as the enemies. Um, I, I think it's just, uh, it's, uh, I, I'm speechless. Uh, we can't wait till Trap Team comes out and, uh, and then pick up our uh, hunting and collecting at that time. I think the only character that we're actually waiting for at this time uh, is is doomstone um everything else with the inclusion of a uh, light core bumble blast uh very recently i think our uh character count is pretty much up to up to date until um of course if you're not counting the variant like jade firecracken which should be according to some uh being released in the next 30 days so anyways just wanted to jump on and share that information sorry it's a, a little bit of a lengthier video than than normal and um appreciate you uh watching and um i said uh before in a previous video i was waiting till we got 100 uh subscribers i think we're four subscribers away from that and uh we're probably going to not probably once we hit that 100 uh, subscribers we will do a um a contest and a giveaway so uh, anyways, again, thanks for watching. Appreciate it. And we will see you on the next video. All right.